Greetings friends, welcome. Today we're looking at the Flexbox DevTools in Chrome and how they can help you uh, get the alignment on your site correct. Particularly when you can't remember the difference between uh, justify content and justify items like me. Uh, right, so look, so say I've got my site here um, and I want to move, I wanted to say move these two adverts over to a line on the left here. Um, so I could do it in the code, uh, but you've got to refresh every time and you can't necessarily s visualize what your Flexbox is doing um, and the DevTools gives you that. So if I just scroll this up, because I've got DevTools open in a separate window here, and then scroll back down. So I'm looking to get these over to the right there. Um, so with DevTools, I can come and select uh, an item and then select this whole box here and when I do this is in Chrome 90 at the moment so it's not in normal Chrome but it will be coming in, in the very next version I think um, so it's just in Canary but if you look down here you can see there's flex on the end of this element now when I click on that well when I hover over it you can see in the website itself that we're getting a visualization of the flex box. Um, and when I click on it, it actually persists that. So when I move off, it's still on the UI over here. So I can see that my, my containing flex has actually got room over here. You know, if that wasn't there, if I didn't have this visual aspect, I wouldn't know whether I can use this room or not, or whether I've got to expand this container. So it gives me that information straight away. Um, so I, I now know I could align these items over to the right here, and that would give me that alignment that I want. Uh, and we can we can still carry on doing that in the Dev Tools. Now, if you look down here, there's actually an extra little icon um, that when we click on gives us a little UI and we can actually play with these things. So I could say, and I know I, well, I don't know, I'm going to try them out. I can use the justify content to move this uh, along the X axis. So let's try and split them all the way. So if I click on this space between one it will apply that so it's applied it just down in here it's behind its own ui um, and we can see that that moves it over so from that i would now know yep yeah, i should come back into my code and do justify content space between um, so it just gives me that that speed and a little bit more confidence of knowing what exactly is going on um, yeah, there, so there you go. The dev tools in Chrome for Flexbox looks as though they should be pretty useful for, for helping out with those alignment issues. Uh, there you go. Thanks for watching. If you like that, give me a thumbs up, a uh, thumbs down if you didn't. Don't forget to click that subscribe button below for future updates. And I'll catch you next time. Bye.